Hi, my name is Peter Ong, and welcome back to Backyard Birding. In this episode, we are going to learn more about woodpeckers. Malaysia has 26 species of woodpeckers, so there's a really high chance that you'll discover more than one species in your neighborhood. Woodpeckers are keystone species of our ecosystem, as they keep the pest population under control. They also act as ecosystem engineers, for many of them build their nests by excavating a hole in tree trunks. This allows other cavity nesting animals, such as barbets, hornbills, and a whole host of others to take over the tree cavity once the woodpecker has left. Therefore, green areas such as these play an important part in the preservation of biodiversity in our city. Woodpeckers and many other birds and animal species rely on these green patches for their very survival. Not all trees are suitable though. Woodpeckers can be very, very choosy parents. Some of them have been known to complete their cavities, only to abandon them for a variety of reasons. So for a lot of woodpeckers, it's in fact a process of trial and error. These Rufus woodpecker parents, however, have found an ideal piece of real estate. The male Rufus woodpecker has a brilliant splash of red on his cheeks. The chicks of this species, however, hatch from eggs blind, sparsely feathered, and a little bit gawky. But they grow up quickly. Each parent returns to the nest at 40 minute intervals throughout the day, ensuring their chicks are well fed, and also to take out the poop that is packed in a mucous membrane as the chick defecates. After three weeks, the chicks are now well developed and become braver in observing their surroundings. This will be the time when the parents will coax their chicks out of the nest by feeding them less frequently and calling from nearby branches. This will go on for a few days before the chicks take their first flight into this big wide world. Another woodpecker you may come across is the orange-backed woodpecker, or Balatuk Dadamera. It is one of the largest woodpeckers here in Malaysia. The male has distinct orange markings with a peculiar top knot on the head. The female is a duller grey, but still a sizable bird. As you can see, the male is pecking away at the bottom of this cavity, high up above the ground. Above him is a female fledgling. He will have to teach his daughter how to look for juicy insect in tree barks. One of the more colourful woodpeckers of Kuala Lumpur is the crimson-winged woodpecker, or Balatok Sayamera. It can be found in various parks throughout the city and doesn't seem to mind the human traffic around it. Another more frequently sighted woodpecker in urban areas is the common flameback or Balato Pinangkachil. While both sexes have iridescent yellow wings, the male has a shocking crown of red. And the female is adorned with a more demure crown of black and white. They have definitely adapted quite substantially for life in the city. Perching on these poles not only gives them a good vantage point to spot insects prey, but also allows for them to spot intruding rivals into their territory. If you have enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel, and feel free to share this video with your friends and family. See you in the next episode, stay safe, and happy bird watching!